Is it early or is late night? We at the after party, so don't act brand new. You could call me in the morning. You might catch me rolling with my Western crew. And you gon' wanna match my high. You be catching feelings, I can see it in your eyes. Got three bad bitches right by my side. You can tell me shit, I'm gonna enjoy this ride. Handy in my cup, I don't give a fuck, I'm tryna feel right. Sonam we're here I'm back with another video and this looks video I'm gonna be sharing my favorite <laughs> fragrance with you all so welcome sunshine squad how is everyone doing like I said this video is gonna be my favorite fragrances so you would like to know what my favorite favorite fragrances are for the year so far um, what I have be sure to keep watching and let's go ahead and get started all right, starting with the first one, I'm actually going to pull up my notes so I can pronounce this stuff correctly. And yeah, I'm gonna pull up my notes. Obviously, this one's not gonna be hard to pronounce, but you know. <laughs> All right, so the first one is the Dolce and Gabbana Light Blue. Oh my gosh, y'all. Like this stuff, it smells amazing. It's like a light, scent but it's like very strong in a sense this is like a i don't have the keynotes but um just smelling it is one of those sprays that is very like strong sorry y'all <laughs> it's a strong spray like i feel like it this is the light blue this one is for the women and men i think this one the scent is actually unisex so it could be for both men and women but I really, really love this. I got this one in a 3.3 foot ounce, the bigger bottle. Um, but yes, this is really, really, really smells really good. Um, I don't pair this with anything. I kind of pair this one on its own because it has such a nice, strong scent. So you really don't need to pair anything with it to like get the smell to like, you know, stand out on its own. All right, the next scent is Ari by Ariana Grande. So I have this, yes, I've been using this stuff like crazy. As you see, I haven't touched the Dolce & Gabbana one because you know like when stuff is like, when you spend like, when you don't go that many places, you, you have your good stuff and then you have your good stuff, okay? So yeah, I have Ari by Ariana Grande, Grandy, however you say her name. Mmm. This one I feel has like a sweet smell and when I wear this one I pair it with similar lotions that have similar scents as it for it to kind of like marry one another. Mm. This one smells really good but yeah so if you like sweeter smells this one is definitely on the sweeter side and definitely a great purchase for you to have. Okay, this has to be in your collection for all my girls that love those like sweet floral like nice little feminine scents this is that definitely that feminine scent and the bottle is really pretty so why wouldn't you want it alrighty the next one is very oh my gosh I love this one hold on I like the smell on okay just so I can figure out like the sense okay so this one is oh I'm about to sneeze why I do that <laughs> okay this one is coach dreams and sunset this is like a very like um I feel like it has a sweet and soft I feel like it has a sweet and like toned down smell like this is for like I mean, I feel like it's a grown, grown scent. Like, this is for a grown person. Like, this is definitely not your teeny bopper type of person. Why isn't it focusing? You suck. Okay, whatever. I, you'll see the picture right here um, when I um pretty much show the picture. I don't know why it's so... The label is, like, white. It's probably why it's doing that. 
but I'll, pop, I'll insert the picture here, the photo here, so you can see the bottle, but it's really a nice, sweet smell. I love the top of it. As you see, the top is really nice and stuff. It kind of like, when I do like that, it kind of lets you see it, but I guess. But yeah, this smells really, really good. Um, I pair that, I feel like this honestly complements any lotion or any body lotion I put on. Um, cause you know how like certain scents you just can't mix them. But I feel like this one I can put on like my lighter, light scent lotion and spray this all over and it doesn't overpower. So yeah, that's a good one. And then my last favorite scent is I Am Juicy Couture. Mm, as you see, I've been using it a lot. Um, this one is I Am Juicy Couture. Um, this one, this is one of my favorite scents. I love it so much. It has like a, also I would say like a softer scent. It's not as like slap you in the face. Like you know how those, those perfumes that kind of just literally just smack you in the face and you're like, whoa, <laughs> it's like too much. <laughs> but this one is like really calm. I love this scent and I really, I'll put you on to one of my combos that I do when I put this one on. So if you love Tree Hut, if you love their body scrubs, you're gonna wanna get Coco Colada, um, the body scrub, and you're gonna wanna exfoliate with that. And then you're gonna wanna go in with the Coco Colada um, body butter by Tree Hut. And then you're gonna wanna mix it with either baby oil or like the Victoria's Secret honey oil that I featured in my last favorites video little shameless plug there and then uh, and then no and then okay and then you're going to spray this all over yo this spray this juicy even though it's like those are like the coco colada is like coconut like scented base these this perfume and that alone just they marry each other like they just get engaged like they have a relationship like they go really well together so that's what i pair with that so yeah let me know in the comments below that is all i have to share with you all my favorite scents but let me know in the comments below what your favorite fragrance is it could be a body spray because i do love me a good body spray like from bath and body works or it could be a perfume, like any like perfume brands out there. Leave them down in the comments below so I can check them out. Um, I love samples. I'm a sample junkie, so when it comes to that, so if you can have, if you have any recommendations, definitely I would love to try samples of it um, before I commit to a full bottle. And that's what I would recommend too. Like if it's a perfume you want to try that I've shown in this little um, haul, definitely get a sample of it first, um, and then kind of wear it, get figure it, let it figure out if it works with your body chemistry then commit to a full bottle okay all right so i will see you all in the next one toodles to my sunshine squad and thank you all for supporting lana day um all the videos i've been posting consistently back to back y'all i'm gonna need a break after this <laughs> um but yeah we, we got one more one more one more day and yeah we'll be complete yes uh.